What is up YouTube? It is Scott Kazan, the Balloon Man, and we are going to learn a two balloon panda bear. You tie both balloons together and then you introduce them once you find your spot. That's the face of the panda. The next thing you're going to do is make the ears. So you're just going to make two one inch bubbles or two inch bubbles since we're using 360s because this balloon is an extremely impressive 360 balloon especially for line work it's the best you take it to the other side and then you use that knot to really tie it in tight and make sure it's not going anywhere you then push the knot through and now you have the two balloons on each end and you're gonna introduce them dead in the middle of that balloon and you're gonna just twist it and it's just gonna sit perfectly in the middle just like that now from there you can go in any direction you want you can make the panda with arms. You can make the panda sitting on a motorcycle. You can even just make a simple bare body, which is what I'm gonna do. And what I'm also pointing at is the face because that is where you're gonna do your artwork. This panda bear, it's about artwork. You can pretty much make any panda bear face you want. So I'm gonna finish up this body with a bear design, a bear body, because I, don't need to put it on a motorcycle this time around but it gives you that ability you know you make the head and then from there the world is at your fingertips you could do whatever you want so this part's important when you push it down to the other end um, it's gonna be interesting because sometimes that back balloon is gonna be more longer than you want it to be and sometimes it's gonna be shorter and you pretty much just twist it in and then really run the excess balloons through the inside of that balloon especially when you break this one you're gonna break it but you're gonna make sure you go in the right direction you're gonna make sure you're going you know towards tying it not unwinding it because you could very easily unwind it if you're not paying attention so there it is there's a panda bear body it's made out of 360 so it looks awesome because it's really big you can even make it out of two sixties if you really want and they're much smaller and for artwork you can pretty much do whatever you want the artwork that I'm doing it's so funny there was a girl that had a panda bear on her t-shirt and I really really liked the panda bear look on her shirt and I made it exactly like that and ever since then that's been the panda bear I've been making and before that I used to make a panda bear with a smile or a panda bear with his tongue sticking out and now I make the panda bear the way I'm making it now and you can see I'm making two circles a small one and then a big one because it's really important that you leave that little circle in the middle that's what makes the panda bear look like a panda oh and by the way in case you haven't noticed it's a blue panda with a blue sharpie thus this is proving that this panda if you're making balloons for girls it's fun to make different colors you don't want to just make a black and white panda all day you're gonna run out of black and white so you're better off just offering how about a pink panda how about a blue panda and you'd be surprised uh, how many nine and ten year old girls ask for a panda with a mustache <laughs> I had to make that because there was so many parties where the nine and ten year old girls want a mustache on their panda the drawing I'm making now is the more traditional panda bear face that I make so there it is there is the really fast really impressive panda that you can crank out when you're really like in a rush and you know it's a two balloon design I actually prefer making it uh, more than I like making penguins now because the penguins three balloons and the pandas two and if you're really feeling generous and you're really feeling like a nice guy and you know you have time you can spruce this panda up by putting a heart on top of its head I just happen to have a Minnie Mouse heart on me but you know you could put a pink heart or a purple heart and for girls that just makes their day it really does so I'm gonna save that Minnie Mouse head because those things aren't cheap and I'm gonna show you guys how to put a stick in the balloon you do it exactly as I'm doing it very simple and then you got a panda bear on a stick now guys listen there's a lot of nice panda bears on YouTube don't get me wrong but why not learn this one I mean trust me I make this balloon all the time and if it wasn't going well I would have learned a new panda by now but this panda has been amazing 
So I've stuck with it because it's just been the fastest, easiest, yet most impressive panda that you're going to find. Thank you so much for watching. Please give my video a thumbs up and subscribe. Alright guys, I'll see you next time.